All right, how's it going? About to do another brew day, but first I'm gonna show you my uh, controller because I had at least one question about it and how it's wired. It's, uh, it's pretty simple. So here's the box. So here's power coming in right here. So I've got hot coming into uh, pin number one on my PID. And then I have that distributed out to coming out to the switch for the element. So that will turn the element on and off. The, the PID will have power, but the element won't. And then I have another hot going out to the pump to control that. And then, so then I got this uh, from the switch. It'll go out to the SSR. And then from the SSR out to the plug. And then the SSR controls the plug for the heating element. Uh, the pump comes out from the same one, goes out to the pump switch, and then that comes out from the switch to the plug, which is where the pump is plugged in right now. Uh, ground is, and then ground comes into the plug right there. Neutral comes in, same thing to the the PID, that's pin two right there, the white wire, and then that goes to the uh, the plug right there. And then the neutral is distributed with this, the, see the little tab still there, and that distributes the neutral to both of those right there. Uh, the SSR control are pins three and four, right there, negative to the negative on the corresponding SSR route there. I'll use white wires for that. Actually, I use, yeah, I use a white wire for the negative, going to the negative the SSR, green wire for the positive, going to the positive the SSR, and then that'll control that. And then right over here, I just use three wires, so there's three wires for the uh, temperature sensor. And then just based on the distribution right there, these two are jumpered for the PID. Let's see there on a the little schematic. Uh, seven is out to the temperature probe. Eight and nine are jumpered and then go out to the temperature probe. 10 goes out to the temperature probe two. And then I just use a XLR adapter right there. And then that, that plugs into the temperature control. Um, so pretty simple little system. Uh, probably not the best way to distribute the power from the PID. So uh, maybe in the future I'll get like a little control block to uh, distribute that out uh, a little better. But it works. So, and power coming in, straight to PID, and the PID breaks out the hots to both the, both the switches. And then from the switch, uh, from the red switch, goes into the SSR, SSR to um, the plug, which plugs into the heating element. And then uh, from the PID to the green switch, and then yeah, from the green switch out to the plug. So I'll try to get a little, little uh, schematic drawn up and then uh, post it online so you guys can see it. But not too complicated. Uh, probably not the best way, but it's just, you know, wanted to get it going. And uh, my electrical skills aren't that great, so uh, it's the easiest way for me to get it up and running. Yeah, hopefully that helps.